Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is kind of a lazy Sunday over here, so my hair is up. I didn't put any makeup on today and my glasses are on. Sundays I always like kind of relax and also clean the house a bit. I usually don't film or anything because I just like kind of upload what I have, but I wanted to go ahead and put up my Ross video because I found so many awesome things. I have filmed this over the past, I would say, three weeks and I compile a huge video of just all of my Ross finds. This is probably the best Ross finds like I've ever seen. Um, the stores are just really stocked up on good stuff, but it just kind of sucks because they only get like one or two of the good stuff and so the things go very quickly but I've been popping into my stores and they've had amazing finds from like Too Faced, Anciate London, Marc Jacobs, lots of good stuff. So we have a really fun video today so let's go ahead and get started. Back at Ross again they have another Marc Jacobs gloss at this location. We found so much in my other video but this one is in Hey You and it's going for $5.99. We also have uh, one of the lip glosses in Tempt Me. So this location has a lot more of the glosses, which are probably my favorite of the line. We also have this from Marc Jacobs, the Lamarck Liquid Lip Crayon in the shade Framboise, going for $4.99. They also have this Lottie London set. We saw this highlight palette in my last video, but this store has a couple more items, including this, which has a ultra glow loose highlighting powder as well as this Sinner liquid eyeshadow, I believe. This is $4.99. Also this product from Zoeva. This is the powerful lip shine gloss in the shade Party With Me, which looks like a sparkly pink. This is going for $3.99, originally $12. It looks like they also restocked on this MAC Mischief Minx Little Leopard palette. These are a bit older though, so I feel like they've been out a few years now. This is going for $17.99, originally $41. I'm back again, and they have so much more Marc Jacobs than yesterday. I found um, another gloss here in Rebel Rebel. Again, these are $5.99, originally, I think, around the $20 price range. This gloss is called Want Me. This is called Pink Steam in the gloss. This is a Lamarck liquid lip crayon, so a little bit different. I think these are older, though, in Night Mauves for $4.99. Here's a liquid lip crayon, it says, but it's in blacker, which is usually a black shade. This is for $4.99. This gloss in the shade Electric, and I found one more lipstick in the shade Detox, so lots and lots. I don't really see too many super neutral colors. I bought the Sugar Sugar one last time, so I think I'm good, but I can't believe how much they have here. I did look up that Detox shade, though, and it looks like it might have the leopard packaging but it's not my favorite color and they also have this eyeshadow it's just a single shadow in daddy o i feel like we've seen this one at tj maxx going for 5.99 and they have this runway gel powder eyeshadow in smoke which has the fun packaging from 2018 though it's kind of old i'm actually shook to my core right now i can't believe this is here like what this is the Too faced peach perfect concealer in the pot like what <laughs> i've never seen this for less than like half off it's 9.99 here it says it retails for 22. um so far i just see this shade in a bisque um definitely picking this up because i've always wanted this just never purchased it for myself even with all the sales but since i see it here i'm definitely going to grab it i cannot i just can't believe this is here Sometimes it pays to wait to buy things, so I am so excited about this find. Let's see if they have any more. Okay, so I came over to another Ross, and they had another shade in a petal. So I picked up the bisque. I'm not even sure what shade I would really be, but I'm just so excited to see these here. And it looks like only each store got like one in. Here's another Runway Omega Shadow. This one's in the shade Rose. Again, this one's a little bit old, 2018. I found another Marc Jacobs lipstick in the shade Georgie Girl. I think this one is a pinky neutral. I might end up picking this one up. There's just so much Marc Jacobs here. Like all the liners, all the lip stuff, lots and lots. We also have from Bare Minerals a highlighter, the Endless Glow highlighter in the shade Whimsy. This is for $9.99, originally $29. And they have this cute little set from Grande Cosmetics. They have really good lip plumpers. And this is a set of three full sizes. It's a fall set. So it says Fall in Love Lip Plumper Trio with three different shades. This is originally $27. And it's going here for $11.99. 
also have this here from The Balm. This is the Meet Matte Hughes Liquid Lipsticks. There's two different shades in Committed and Devoted. These are pretty good, um, very long lasting. They have like a mint cookie scent. It's very yummy. I don't see the price on this one. Oh wait, here it is. $5.99 originally, $18. I think they are full size, possibly. I just found this giant brush set from Pure, but it's like a silicone sponge kind of thing. Kind of weird, but it's called the Pillow Blend Collection. There's four different ones. They look like artiste brushes with the silicone sponge on top. This is going for only $7.99. I don't really like these for applying foundation, but for applying skincare, they're kind of nice to apply face masks. Okay, so I did find some exciting BH palettes also at Ross, which is really cool to see their like city collection. They have these chillin' in Chicago eyeshadow brushes. Very cute. This is going for $7.99. It says originally $10. And I was thinking if they had more palettes, I did find this one, the Love in London, which actually looks very gorgeous. It's like kind of smoky neutrals, a little bit of olive greens in there. I've been really loving BH palettes lately. I feel like since this collection came out, they've just been on the up. Um, this is $7.99, originally $17. I might pick this one up. I really like the tones here. This item is here too from Butter London. It's the Wink Matte Liquid Eyeliner. This is only $3.99. It says it's originally $12. I think it actually is more like $18 or $20. Usually, I think it's just a black liquid liner. I wanted to show you that Ross also has some like good purses too. These are Kate Spade bags, and they're only $69.99, which it says compared at $208. They have this black one and this mauve one, which looks a little bit dirty, but that would probably wipe away. But I thought that was a really good deal for those. Just a nice little crossbody. I have this one from Michael Kors. It's like a dusty lavender. It looks like they're Selma um, style, which I like Michael Kors. I feel like their bags are pretty like good, they hold up a while. This is $109.99. I have mine here and it's seriously lasted me for years. Came to Ross a different day and now they have the Chillin' in Chicago palette to go along with the brushes. Kind of partial to this one just cause I do live kind of by Chicago. It's like the closest bigger city to me so I've been there a lot of times but this is really cute. It is very warm toned though. I kind of want to get it. It is $7.99. I did end up buying the London one though because I really like the color scheme but this one's pretty cute as well so I'm going to think about getting this too. Then looking down here they actually have the Supernova palette from them as well. I feel like we might have seen this one at TJ before. It reminds me of Star Wars, the font and everything. This is going for $8.99. It's 18 baked eyeshadows. So I have this new Real Techniques brush which is really pretty. It's part of their Cashmere Dream collection. This is their complexion brush. It's really big as well. <laughs> I'm kind of curious about this. It's going for only $2.99, so very cheap. It's made with apparently cashmere bristles, and it's limited edition. It looks really pretty. I think that's the only one they have so far in that line. This skincare section, they also have this really cute little eye cream from Tony Moly. This one's actually on clearance, so it must have been here for a while. It's $6.49. Well, the box says that, but the products is $8.99. I don't know. They might have just put the clearance tag on here, but it's really cute. It's like in the shape of a little whale. Okay, I'm kind of shook that I found this as well. I'm pretty sure this is the TikTok viral skincare product from Innisfree. I think this is sold out on Sephora, but they have it here at Ross. The Dewy Glow Tone Up Cream with Jeju Cherry Blossom. I think I'm going to pick this up. It's only $9.99 here compared at $25. And yeah, I'm pretty sure this is like impossible to find. So it's crazy that it ended up here. I looked it up. It's a little bit different. This one is the same line, but it says Jelly Cream. And this one says Tone Up Cream. So I'm not sure what the difference is but this is the sold out one this one maybe is the old version Back to Ross a different day and they do have a few new really exciting things including this from Too Faced they have the primed and peachy cooling matte primer we have not seen this at any discount stores yet even though we have seen a few things from the peach line but really cool to see this one it is a little bit scented this one I have tried before and it's okay I wouldn't say it's my favorite it does kind of give like a blurring feel and it is cooling on the skin this is only $7.99 although this I think is a mini because or at least half the size because it does look small it says 0.67 ounces I would 
think the full size would be one ounce. In the corner and I saw another peach product, the Peach Mist. So Ross seems to be getting the whole Too Faced Peach collection slowly but surely. <laughs> I've only seen like one of each item. We saw the foundation, the concealer, and now we also have the mist and the primer. No palette though, but this is the full size matte setting spray. I don't think we've seen this one before. I know this one had some issues like you have to shake it up really good, but I did like it and it smells really good too. So this is $14.99 here, originally $32. And then I also spotted this. I used to love these. The Ciate London Glitter Flips. It's a liquid lipstick and when you press your lips together, it's like the glitter activates and it's really pretty. It's a nice neutral too. We got Undressed and this is going for only $3.49. Oh my goodness. So cheap. It says... Compared at 9.50, I think that's the sale price. So they're usually like 18 to 20. And they have another glitter flip color in the shade Fortune. Here's another glitter flip, a red one. This one's in trouble. Along with the Too Faced stuff, I thought I would mention you can also find the Too Faced Natural Lust palette here if you are on the hunt for it. It's an okay one. It's for 29.99. And they had a couple liquid lipsticks, the metallic ones. This is I Dare You for nine dollars originally 21 and they also have the shade and our lips are sealed this ross seriously is like the jackpot right now i just found more siate london we saw those glitter flips um earlier a couple days ago and now they have these highlighters which look stunning this is the glow 2 highlighter it says illuminating powder highlight i know we got like a siate london highlight in boxycharm but i don't think it was this one it's in solstice going for 7.99 originally 32 and they have this shade too, which looks like a deeper tone. This one is in Celestial. I can't believe this is here as well. We've been seeing some really exciting Too Faced finds. Um, these aren't even at TJ Maxx yet. This is the Diamond Light Diamond Fire Bronzer. I do have this, and it's not my favorite on me. I think it works well for a medium to deeper skin tone because um, it's really like shiny and it has almost like a reddish tint to it. This is for $19.99, originally $36. So cool. Also from Ciate, we have the marbled metals. These are really pretty um, glittery eyeshadows. I don't think they're a cream I think they're like a pigment but it says metallic glitter eyeshadow we have the shade wicked here I would definitely recommend these they're stunning this is for $5.99 originally 24 so lots of good Ciate stuff popping up at Ross which is very cool because we never see this brand that much at TJ or Marshall's another Ciate marble shadow they have this one's in the shade gilded another one of the glitter flips they have is in the shade infamous this is for $3.49. I might pick that one up. I don't think I have it. Um, and let's see, this one is candy. So they literally have like all the colors. I just can't believe how cheap these are. $3.49 is such a good deal for those. We also have this Ciate product called Liquid Chrome. It is a dual chrome lip lacquer from them for $4.49 and the shade is Venus. Alright, I do want to quickly share what I bought at the stores. I did end up getting that Peach Perfect concealer. As you guys know, I picked up the shade Petal. I was so excited to finally be able to try this. I've always wanted it, but I feel like it got very mixed reviews and it went on sale pretty soon after it was released. But I really love a lot of the peach perfect line from Too Faced and we've been seeing it at the stores lately at Ross but this is their instant coverage concealer which looks like this and basically it's a pot concealer it kind of reminds me of like the NARS soft matte so this is more over something I would use for blemishes rather than under the eyes since it is matte but it's supposed to give amazing coverage so I was so excited to see that there and then also I couldn't believe we found these amazing BH palettes I feel like whenever I'm at the discount stores I always see like the older BH palettes that no one really cares about but now like their formula has gotten so good and I'm really into their products I can't believe I found these from their travel line these are like the first ones they did so I've got the love in London so beautiful kind of these smoky tones a little bit of blues in there 16 shades I'll just swatch a couple this one is called oh my gosh palace how beautiful it does feel similar quality to their avocado toast which I love this one's called Biscuit. Oh my goodness, these are so nice. If you guys see these, definitely pick them up. I really want to get their new travel ones. They have like the LA one and also the Aspen. But these are so beautiful. Highly recommend their shadows. And this is such a good deal, even though it was like $8, which might seem like a lot for BH. It's compared at $17, so still a steal of a price. 
And since I love it so much, I also got the Chicago one just because I love Chicago. It holds a special place in my heart. So I had to pick this one up as well. Here is the Chillin' in Chicago. Definitely a little bit more warm tone, but still very pretty neutrals in here. So we got Magnificent. This is for Magnificent Mile where all the shopping is. We have the shade Wrigleyville for the Cubs. Love, love, love to see that. So pretty. What else? The Bean. Oh my gosh, this is so nostalgic. So we got two neutral palettes, but I think I'm going to get a lot of use out of these. Amazing quality. So excited to find those at Ross. So that is what I picked up this week at the stores and everything that I found. Such good finds. You guys will have to let me know if you go to your Ross as well. And if you guys find anything, I'm super curious to see what you guys picked up. But that is it for this video. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.